Uh, do you know what this is? Yeah. Are there multiple of these? No, that's the only one. Did not think I would ever have my hands on one of these. Saved from being literally thrown away. Adult XL, Barney tees. Oh, okay. I don't want to pay oh, okay. near that, you know. Okay. It's everything I got in that little deal. So we decided on 20 pieces. Hello, you guys, and welcome back to the channel. Or if you guys are new here, my name is Jackson. I run a vintage clothing brand called Loveless Vintage. And today we are going to go see my wholesaler. I buy vintage clothes from him wholesale at a low rate. And then I sell it on my Depop or on my Instagram for a higher rate. So today we're going to go there. We're going to buy some pieces off of him and i actually have sort of a business venture idea for him i'm gonna pitch him this idea there is this live selling platform called whatnot you guys might have heard of it i did sell on it over a year ago i did a few whatnot lives and the first one went absolutely crazy it was amazing it's an easy and fast way to sell vintage clothing anything actually people sell video games pokemon cards anything on whatnot i'm sure you guys have heard of it if not my whatnot link will be in the description below so that's kind of the goal of today buy some wholesale show you guys what i bought buy and see if we can restart this whatnot journey. We're going to see if I can help my wholesaler sell all of his inventory. So yeah, kind of a different video. If you guys like this type of content, make sure to drop a like. It is the easiest and simplest way to show your support to my channel. It is free. It literally takes two seconds. Just drop a like on this video. It helps with the reach of my channel. I appreciate you guys all so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe to follow me on Instagram and let's get into this wholesale buyout and this conversation that I'm going to have with my wholesaler. Wish me luck, you guys. All right, this is all new stuff, so we're gonna go through this entire box right now. Before we get into the wholesale buyout, I wanted to give a quick shout out to today's video sponsor, Vendu. You guys know I never do sponsorships or ads on my YouTube, but when Vendu reached out to me and I saw what the software that they offered was, I needed to collaborate with them. Vendu is a cross-posting software that you guys can use right on your phone to cross-post all of your items to Depop, eBay, Mercari, all of the online reselling platforms. I've been using Vendu to cross-post all of my Depop posts onto eBay, and it's been such an easy, streamlined, simple experience, you guys. Guys, they also offer inventory control. It's a simple solution to cross posting and cross listing that I've never thought to do because I thought it would take so much time. And with Vendu's help, it's been so easy to cross post from Depop to eBay. And I've already seen sales coming in through eBay sales that I would have made without Vendu's help. So thank you so much to Vendu for sponsoring this video and sponsoring my channel. If you guys want to check out Vendu, it'll be the top link in the description below. Thank you again, Vendu, for sponsoring my channel. Pretty cool. Hard Carl Welk. Nice little message there. <laughs> yeah, but this is all stuff that we're gonna potentially make some wholesale deals on. So, like this, for sure, is something that I'd want for my Depop. Dude, why, do you see the, the pocket placement on this shirt? <laughs> it's like yeah. in the middle. Oh, this is kind of sick. Yeah, I thought that was kind of sick. Bro, the triple X root beer? No, I, I, I didn't know that was a thing. Dude, this is actually sick. Now what did I do with that pencil? She's got the thermometer behind the ear. Oh, God. Did you not know that's what that <laughs> was? Yeah. <laughs> oh, sick. Yeah. This is like obviously small though, but that's so sick. The child's cap. Yeah, the little child's cap, World Industries. Flame boy. Oh, I, yeah, I was going to do some work with that. I thought that was cool. <laughs> in this? <laughs> yes. In the little, come on, man. Little fun little patches. Uh, What's up? Gage. What? Dude, are you fucking serious? What? You Do you know what this is? No, what is it? Bur <laughs> what is it? Don't come here. I'm so glad. Dude, I'm so glad I'm recording. Holy. What? And this is an XL. What? Are you? You can't be. Are there multiple of these? No, that's the only one. Dude, are you? I thought that was the coolest one. Dude, are you serious? What is that? <sighs> Bro, this is a Nike Geisha running tee. Bro, this is, I. This is in like a dead stock condition. Okay, you're losing my mind right now. What is this? What is this? Bro, okay, YouTube's gonna explode. This is 
Dude, I... This is like over a thousand dollars. Are you serious right now? <laughs> are you you're, are you joking? No, I'm not joking. I could, dude, and I so could have said, oh, this is a cool shirt. I'll buy it for five dollars. Dude, um, you're are you for real? Yeah, I'm for real. Yeah, I haven't seen it. I haven't seen one on this tag. It Holy. might it might be a different variation because normally they're on like the I think they're on like a blue Nike tag. Um, but yeah, this is a Nike Geisha. It looks a. I don't know if this looks a little bit different, dude. That's actually crazy um what the hell perfect xl single stitch um Dude, i knew okay i knew that it was like this had to be something cool because it's like not like covered in sponsors or whatever bruh this is in literally perfect condition bro you cannot be shitty right dude now, dead stock condition we're gonna yeah we're gonna look i'll look it up on ebay let me Holy get a better <laughs> oh but this is on that, yeah, the, the Nike T tag, right? Yep, yeah, no, yeah, that's the tag it's normally on. But like, uh, when I came over and you said you got a bunch of marathon and running tees live out of this box, you guys, <laughs> like, what the hell? The Nike Geisha Grail. That is, wow, absolutely crazy. Did not think I would ever have my hands on one of these. And, yeah. It's nuts. Okay, wait, can I, can I get you on film thing that one more time? What'd you say about I the neck? I said my coworker, what mm -hmm. she said was, Gage, if you weren't working here, we would take those clothes. And we said, oh, people clothes, get them out of here. Bruh. So I <laughs> saved a grail. Uh, so Nike Geisha shirt saved from being literally thrown away. Crazy. Crazy. Oh, that's sick. Is it right there? Oh, no, yeah. But that's so sick. Oh, bro, you know me. You know what I like. Orange County. North Dakota. Yeah. These are like ones I'm into, but I'd probably be like a little bit lower on. Just that's like fine. spring, like, yeah. you know, and then like random car shirts. Oh, yeah, that, that one, and then the other one's a Nike one. One of them, I think. Oh, yeah, yeah. see, okay, this is a good one, bro. Like, this is a pinwheel tag. Yeah, this is that tag, you know? The mm -hmm. Nike pinball tag. Large. I think the dude ran the race and they just stored the shirt. In Probably. The yeah, they, they look like they've never been worn. Governors, trophy run, run for fun. Yeah, so like the, like things like this, like these tags, like I'd, I'd put these to the side like with the Geisha because I don't know, like that that could be worth something more, you know? Yeah, so here's another one. It's the same tag. No, that's a different one. Okay, so yeah, super string stars. But still, I mean, it's the same as the other ones. So I probably would just put it with it. So like I said, this is like probably like a lower in stack. Mm -hmm. This is like some of the better-ish stuff. I mean, prices are for sure gonna like vary in here. Let's see. So we got the Orange County, the Tacoma Marathon, this Mariners, the Tweety is in here, which mm -hmm. is definitely like one of the better pieces. Tweety, uh, the Welk. Seven Up, this racing tee, this marble tee, the pencil, the Boston, and the night the not Nike, Nike on the brain, the Mickey puffer. So one eleven. Eleven pieces. Do you have any idea? Uh I know the Tweety, the racing, and that 7 Up one's pretty good. Did you look up the 7 Up? Like this is 7 Up? I think it's like a forty dollar shirt. Oh really? Damn right. Oh, well, it's like 88, I guess. Mm -hmm. I literally evaluated it at like 25 or something. I didn't, I didn't know it was that much. Did you just do um, 100 for the whole, all of it? So... 19 pieces? Tw 20 with like this thrown in or whatever. Yeah. Right? So 20 for 100? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's true. Okay. Cool. In the pit. Mm -hmm. It's very sick though. Dude, I love this <laughs> shirt, bro. <laughs> this stress out cat shirt. Very, very sick. A Harley on a oh yeah, yeah. Zwift tag okay. But I thought the print was oh super yeah sick. no this print is super dope. It's nice fade on it too. Sure yeah. Dude, this shirt is so sick. <laughs> <laughs> Never a dull moment and it's a bunch of vegetables getting chopped. <laughs> what outweighs me like really liking your shirt like to thinking everyone else will like it like yeah. you know I'm like dude I want to buy this because it's sick but like will anyone else even care about this or think yeah. it's cool? That's but. how I feel about all my new shirts that I get. <laughs> yeah. The bricks and done like but is this like a motorcycle? Yeah, motorcycle. Yeah. But it's the wrong your, right? I'm not crazy, right? Yeah, yeah, it is. It's the wrong your. Dad, you're my dad. But Y O U R. Dang.
even like licensed and everything. So this had yeah, to go through mul this had to go through multiple people. Yeah, that did not get passed. Yeah. 1995 <laughs> colorblind licensed. So, um, wow. They're not colorblind. They're just illiterate. Yeah, no. <laughs> Dude, I have this exact same <laughs> shirt, and I can't sell it for the life of me, bro. I literally have this exact. And it's like the exact same size too, bro. I cannot sell it. Love my little nature tees. Tell me, Dad. My dog walks all over me. Get it? This is a pop ring. <laughs> okay, so little stack of uh, Depop lows, mids, whatever. Um, we got one, 13, 14. Let's say some of the better tees. We got like Harley, the stressed out, this one. Um, mm, those were obviously the only three. Yeah. Ones. About 50 bucks. Yep, that sounds perfect to me. So you know me with jeans. Like, oh, they're good size. Pretty picky. Like 30, isn't it? Four car hearts. Yeah, they're all like 38. What are you thinking? If you want those, I'll do 65. With those thrown in? Yeah. It's just like these are like, like I, I get it. You're just, you want, you want to just like toss them to me. I get it. But like they're, I don't know, they're like, like I'd maybe sell them for like 25 a piece, but they're going to like sit forever because they're mm. not like actually vintage ones. They're just like 2000s ones. This is like a slower seller for sure because it's like bigger. This isn't like the traditional double knee that everyone's looking for. So like these are the best two ones here and they're both like bigger sizes. It's, okay, we can just build. Whoop. We can do 55. <laughs> 55 for this stack. We got the new personal right here. Hooters calendar photo staff. Straight to dome with this one for sure. That's dope. Nike International. Oh, this one? Uh, just an essential. Oh, uh, yeah, this for sure was on white tag. White tag cut, Nike Essential. This is probably the only of the better one. Oh, that's, that's sick. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, actually, these two. Fizzazz? Fizzazz pout, bro, what is this? This is crazy. Huh. Where'd you get this one? At work. Huh. Oh, it says flower power. Oh, that's sick. I've never seen anything like that. Flower power. Still. Basically, yeah, you know what I do when I'm doing yeah, this. Yeah. I'm like, my bottom dollar I could get for them. I valued it around like 30-ish. Yeah, I gotcha. Is like what I thought. I don't know, what about like 60? Yep, that's good. Perfect. <laughs> this one I have no idea. I'll probably honestly list it kind of high, but like, yeah. I don't know. This is that. What is this again? Triple, Triple H. H. Triple H. Yeah. Oh, is this like a giant tag? Did you get? Did you get this off alive or something? No, I'm work. That one in the insane. We're in the same batch. Yeah. Um. This is so sick. My friend was just asking me to find her an insane shirt the other day, but I think she wants an XL. If I were to just buy like these three straight up, you have an idea? Where are we at now, 265? I think so. Do you want to just round up to three? Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Cool. Pantera, XL Backstreet Boys with the like Beach Boys logo, honestly. And then the large in sync. Did you find, like, did you, we got adult XL Barney tees. Did you look up or try to find any? Cause I, I don't even know if I've seen. So we like have a bunch of them, I guess, but. So like, there's the same one, but like someone's obviously taxing on it. Right. But like, yeah, same one, like 150-ish. I was gonna say, I like, I would probably value around 152-ish. Right. I don't know, yeah. yeah. 16 T deal. Let's see if we can come to an agreement. XL South Park medium. This one is really sick. Bummer's medium. Sonic medium. Medium, all these mediums. 3XL cowboy. What else we got? Alan Jackson, Social Distortion, Elvis, Marilyn Monroe, Batman, Batman, Lion King, one and a half with the back hit, Star Trek, Dale AOP, and the Smashing Pumpkins. Let's see, let's see. What I do, literally what I do is I do a quick value of like all, like the minimum I think I can get for them, you know? And then normally, I just see like where you're at too, because I know some of these you paid, you paid up for. I honestly think that's around what I could get for all of it. Oh really? Yeah. So yeah, we're, we're probably way too far apart, honestly. Okay, well then, go ahead. This is the part where you go off. 
<laughs> you want me to make an offer? Yeah. I literally, at minimum, what I could get for them, I value them all around like seven fifty, okay. and that's like what I could, what I could get, like mm -hmm. minimum, you know, for like what I could sell them for. So oh, okay. I don't want to pay oh, okay. near that, you know, okay. and yeah. So I don't know if we're gonna be able to come to a deal on that. The deal doesn't even have to happen, you know. Right, There's yeah. no pressure. I mean, yeah, like if I was gonna buy it straight up for all, like for all of it, mm -hmm. I feel like the most I could do for like all of it is probably like around four hundred. Mm -hmm. And like then it's like I don't even know if I can double up off of that. I'll do the four. Okay, so you're down to do four for. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, let's do it. Okay. <laughs> Last minute through in this Terminator 2 Judgment Day. It is newer age though. This is like a silky tag, but it's everything I got in that little deal. I think we can both obviously make some money. Well, he's making the money. I gotta make the money now. But four hundo for all of this stuff. The Marilyn Monroe, Elvis, Social Distortion, Allen, this, Nintendo, Sonic, this boy, Cowboy. All right, we took the Cowboy Bebop out for 320. So there's a little update, but we got all this stuff for 320. Great still. Yes, great deal still. Okay, so we decided on 20 pieces of gauges that we're going to do on whatnot. All for a dollar? Start them all at a dollar? Uh, sure. Okay, we're gonna start We're gonna start them all at a dollar. All on whatnot. I'll put the date up here if we've decided uh, and it's come out by now. So these are all the pieces. We got Halo Wars. We got the, my favorite band ever, the Beatles. We got Johnny Cash, this Anthrax, Power Man 5000, Three Stooges. We got some Winnie the Pooh. We got the Broncos, New York. This is a really nice one. Large New York Speed Racer. We got an Umbro T. We got this uh, Oregon Ducks, Disneyland, Donald Duck. We got Walt Disney, little Native T. We got the Joker, Triple H, and then another Mad Engine. No way. Are we going to do it? Yeah. You think so? Yeah. Dang. XL. Super. Is it Atrigon, right? Yeah. Super Atrigon. This is a uh, yeah, classic anime. Not many people know Single about stitch. it. Single Stitch. Yeah, XL 20 through 31. All right, we're gonna do this. Yeah, this will be good. This will be good. We're gonna do this one too. So make sure you guys uh, follow me and whatnot. Oh, like, what? I don't even know what to say, you guys. That was crazy. I did not think me coming to a little wholesale appointment would start with me unearthing a Nike Geisha. That's like a once in a lifetime find, like absolutely crazy. Early Nike T, Grail. If there's anybody watching this video that is serious, and I mean a serious buyer, feel free to hit me up on Instagram. I'm basically gonna be the one selling it for him. He doesn't really wanna deal with it. So please, if you are serious, DM me on Instagram. It is not going to be cheap, you guys. The last like mediums that sold that were thrash sold for like 600, 700. It is a perfect condition XL. I am guaranteeing you it is, it's not gonna be anything under $1,000. It's probably gonna be more than that too. But if you guys are interested in anything else you saw in this video, I did buy some wholesale. I showed you guys most of everything I bought personally for myself for wholesale that I'm gonna be putting on my Depop or you can buy it for me directly on Instagram. All of those other shirts, 21, I believe are all going to be for sale on whatnot. I'm also going to have some shirts for sale on whatnot and that whatnot will be April 30th on a Sunday. It is the last day of April, April 30th, Sunday. It's going to be at 6 p.m. PST. If you guys don't have whatnot, you can sign up using my link and I think you get 15 or 20 bucks of free credit to spend. So if you guys want to come get a free vintage shirt or a potential discount on a vintage shirt during the live, you guys want to bid on it. You guys will have some free spending money. If you guys have not signed up, you can use my link. What a crazy video. Hopefully you guys liked it. Me kind of buying some wholesale you're getting to see my thought process when buying and some of the prices i pay and stuff like that thank you guys so much for watching the video make sure to like it make sure to subscribe i'll see you guys in the next one this is jackson's loves vintage peace